Hi all. In this video, we are going to see how to extend the RDP license grace period. Now, here we can find how many days left of grace period. This is a command. This is a command. When we enter this command, it will show how many days we have a license period. So it shows zero. So we reached the license limit. The grace period has been completed. So we don't have a license for RDP. Now we are going to extend the RDP license. How? So in our registry, we have to go through this path. Go to registry. Reg edit by the command. In this regi reg registry, we have to go to the path local machine system. So, the air local machine, go to local machine, go to system. Here we have control set. So, we have a current control set. So, we have a current control set. Then, go to control. So in this control we have to go terminal server. So it's terminal server. Here we can go. Here's the terminal server. Here we have to locate RCM. RCM. Here we can, we have a grace period. So this, not down this uh, not on this registry path. Bot should be correct one. So, local mission system, current control set, control terminal server, RCM, then grace period. Okay, now we have to delete this registry. Before deleting the registry, we should have the administrative privileges. So, we should have this administrative privileges. So, if you have permission, then only we can able to delete the registry. Okay, let us, let us try to delete the registry. So if you want to delete, yes. Honorable delete face it very well. Because of we don't have privilege, we have to set the privilege by permissions tab. Here we have to add the privilege. So now we have the permissions. Now we can try to delete. Yes, now we can be able to delete the particular registry entry. Default, we can leave the default folder. Okay, okay. So once we delete the registry entry, after the restart, then only it will be effect to extend the grace period. Let us reboot the server. So now we will reboot the server. It's okay. So see the days left. We don't have a days. Okay, let's just reboot the server. Now the server has been rebooted. Now let us check the grace period. Okay. This is a command. This is a command which is used to show the grace period of or show the license expiry date of RDP. Okay, let us go to command, go to run, run as administrator, then go to 
paste yeah now successfully we have extend the rbp license see here earlier it was showing us zero now it was showing us 120 so rdp license grace period time is 120 days now it has been extended by the help of deleting the registry thank you for watching the video